plasma burster missiles. An overclock that went from zero to hero ever since season four was introduced. I meant to make a video on this overclock, but unfortunately, I accidentally deleted the video. And I didn't realize until it was too late. Anyways, plasma burster missiles, what does it do? Well, first and foremost, it makes missiles pierce right through enemies like butter. And also with the current upgrade pathing that I have, it makes the missiles turn at such a hyper velocity rating that the missiles will continuously come back and hit the targets repeatedly, continuing to do damage. And not only that, the damage alone that the missiles are able to do is absolutely huge. So today, let's go out and cause some justice reigns from above. Honestly, if you haven't used this overclock yet, uh, you are most definitely gonna, lo are gonna love it if you're... What is this spawn with a bunch of freaking swarmers? Well, it's a good thing I brought Hellfire with me. But no, if you have never used this overclock before, um, you are honestly going to love it if you uh, plan on using it after you uh, watch this video. Because this overclock has honestly surprised me ever since I started using it. Oh my god, this is a spawn. Hold on, let's, uh, let's assess the situation really quick. But no, the plasma burster missiles just, they pierce through target targets like butter, and if you're able to keep your aim locked onto a single target, the, the rockets will orbit around and just keep going through the uh, the flesh of a target, and it will rip rip them to freaking shreds. And I don't know why, but it's just insanely satisfying. It literally just rends them apart as you keep them locked on. Like a Praetorian, for example, is definitely a good candidate for this because... Yeah, as you keep your target locked, it just rends them apart. It's so freaking amazing. Even just with two rockets... Those grunts are just donezo. And the rockets will stay around for quite a while, honestly, too. Like, they have quite a bit of, uh, time- Ooh, a hoarder. Hmm, I wonder how that's gonna go. Considering the fact that he has no weak spots. And I kind of really need weak spots because against his Praetorian, if I hit him in the weak spot, oh my god, it shreds him like no freaking problem. But no, this is an overclock that went from zero to here really quick. Even against a Spitball Infector? I think I heard a leech... Not too sure, though. I might have heard a leech. Thank you for kill me. Well, thank you Did I hear a leech? Yeah, for some reason I thought I heard, like, the frickin' leech uh, retreating or some whatnot, but I don't know. But, uh, we'll, we'll try it out on the uh, hoarder in just a momento. Um, I just want to make sure I get some resources here. For some reason I keep talking in a German accent because of the fact that it's Oktoberfest. Alright, uh, it's gonna go bad if I do that, though. Against a Fester Flea? Yep. Against a tiny target, though. Like, that's the one thing. You really just have to- Oh, god damn it. It hit him? No, he's gonna get away because- Oh my god, I- Hoarders continue to be the bane of my existence to this very day because of the fact that their ass keeps sitting outside of the damn wall as they go through the wall, and it tricks the hell out of me every single time. Ghost ship, fix your goddamn game. No, I'm just kidding. I love you, ghost ship. But really, because, like, the freaking limbs are just so freaking, like, weird on the damn hoarder, if it goes through the wall, its ass just loves to hang outside of the wall and just get sucked in later on, and... That honestly is the most triggering thing when you're trying to kill a hoarder. Like, it is 100% without a doubt, like, of why hoarders uh, remain alive to this very day. If I had a cryo cannon, oh my god, I'd be able to kill him easily. But the fact that his he did the shenanigans on me today, uh, unfortunately, that's just, that's just the way the cookie crumbles, unfortunately. Speaking of which, I did have some cookies uh, earlier before I started today with some milk, and I'm like, mm, yes, cookies. How did you wake up? Nice voice crack me. Oh, what is it with the Swarmers? Hello? Swarmer Gen's not on. Ooh, I don't know if that goose sack screwed me over, but I think we're fine. And Swarmer Gen's not active. I don't know what's up with the Swarmers. Ooh. There we go. But yeah, with the upgrades I have, uh, the weak point damage is definitely there, even for a freaking rocket-type weapon. Oh, no! Why is there two more? 
Is there a secret warning going on with a spitball infestation? Is that what it is? That'd actually kind of be terrifying if there was actually a spitball uh, infestation warning. Like, not gonna lie, that'd be terrifying. There's a lot of Bismarck here, too, which is what I'm thankful for as well. Um, yeah, Nitro here. I did see some Nitro right there, too, so let's go and get some eggs, shall we? Make a little omelette while we're at it. I'm hoping I get a swarm out of one of these. To demonstrate the raw power of the Plasma Buster missiles. Ah, yes. Thank you very much, Mission Control, for bringing me your delightful gifts of a swarm of bugs. I don't know why I'm trying to sound like Richthofen from COD Zombies. To be honest, I really miss playing COD Zombies. I remember I used to make YouTube videos back in the day where I would play a single Zombies map and I would try to make it past Wave 20. I remember that was a thing back in the day that I used to do. I wonder if I should bring that back again, I don't know. But against Wardens, they have no problem uh, just ripping him to the pieces. And even against Matera Goo Bombers, Dunzo. Boop. But I'm also using a Hellfire with a Coil Gun because it's definitely going to help with uh, killing a bunch of bugs as well. Because uh, I'm probably going to be running out of ammo quite frequently with the Rocket Launcher. Because I literally am having way too much fun with this freaking overclock. It's just so good. Like, even if there's just, like, a horde of bugs, it just does not give a single, like, crap about anything. And you can tell I'm having fun because I'm, like, just dying, too. Uh, I have cluster nades, that's right. That was loud. Okay, let's see. I got a dirt path behind me. I got three inches left until my death. I'm almost out of ammo. And there's a swarmer on my, uh... Never mind, there was a swarmer. It was funny, that was only one swarmer that it decided to spawn in the whole damn, uh... Um, horde. You know it's a good overclock when you're already almost out of ammo. Like, oh my god, it's so fun. Okay, six missiles against a warden. Hitting his weak spot. Damn. But hey, you do get the message. It definitely does work. This is some weird-ass uh, cave generation, I'm not gonna lie. I'll put a zipline down there, too. Yeah, there's a lot of Bismar down here, too, which is nice. I see those assholes in the darkness. Okay, now I can get a resupply. I got one egg secure. Rich atmosphere sometimes can be really fun. Do I see Nitra right there? I do. I love the fact that I can just see glimpses of shines of Nitra just in the darkness. I love that. No, you listen, Naive. Navi. Did I call it Naive? Whoops. Clearly, I'm not a true Zelda player or Zelda fan. I side with Ganondorf, obviously. It was your destiny to pick up the legendary Master Sword. And afterwards, Ganondorf took every took over everything unopposed. Hmm. No, wait, that's not right. Okay. All right, we got Jada's. We got a lot of uh, resources to go through too, which is nice. That is what I like to see. I don't know what it is about Ridge Atmosphere, but it feels like I'm playing uh, like a fast-paced movement game. Kind of like Titanfall, really. Like, the movement is just there, too. God, I said Titanfall, and everybody's gonna be like, Titanfall? The Titanfall revival is actually kind of crazy, though, with the update and whatnot. Oh, that's a... That was a leech. Hi there. I. It's a good thing I can hear that, too. Hold on, I'll get to you in just a moment, my, my, my man. I knew I heard a leech in here somewhere, I just didn't know where the hell it was. 
And yes, I'm also running uh, the uh, senses uh, perk because of the fact that, once again, I still suffer from uh, silent cave leeches, unfortunately. I need to call resupply before I freaking die. But yeah, silent cave leeches are still uh, killing me, and that's why I run the, ran the uh, the senses mod, or not the senses mod, excuse me, the uh, the perk. What what is it called again? I'm so stupid. Heightened senses. Okay, there it is. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. I just ran into my goddamn supply pod as I called it down. Blue Ghost, what the fuck are you doing with your life? I don't know. I just work here. I really need to kill these goo bombers. There's like fr freaking three of them, and they are just making my life miserable right now. Or at least just kill their sacks. That is not what she said. Oh, Christ on a mother effing stick. Alright. Gotta remember that there's a lot of more nitro around here to go to. Uh, oh, hi. How are you? There's some over here. Does this one shot a uh, Fester Flea still? It does. Noise. There we go. Nope. It is so hard to track them. I'm getting good at it, though. Okay, there's another warden. I see the pink particles right there. Don't know who the hell he's protecting, though. He's protecting something. At, get your booty back here, mister. I'm not done with you yet. There we go. For a second, I thought that was a leech coming to grab me, but that was just my missiles, and I was like, oh, no, we're fine. We're fine. <laughs> okay, Bosco, go ahead and fetch me. Never mind, don't fetch me another egg. That one's already gotten. I, I didn't mean to call that down. I meant to get down my shield. Oops. You know what? That's fine. We'll have more nitro anyway. God, the moment where I fat finger my damn... Uh, supply pod button instead of pulling out my shield, which I'm trying to frickin' still get used to again. God damn it. God, I love this overclock. Honestly, this is a good combo with a coil gun. Nice voice crack, by the way, Blue Ghost, but it's just so good. This is one of the reasons why I still continue to play Gunner to this day. Besides, like, Neurotoxin Catalyst as well, and even the Mind Layer system, which I think I want to make a video on that later on, too. We'll see how that goes. Alright, so I remember that Bosco got me some Jada. Okay, we need to secure these Jadas. There is a lot of resources here. There's even... God damn! God damn! There we go. One Jadas. I can't seem to get out of here. Thank you. And there's more Bismar over here, too. Ooh, we're rich with resources. It's still throwing me off that I turn my particles back on. I wanted to turn them back on because, uh... Well, I think that my game is actually running a lot more smoother now. Famous last words. That's the one thing about this game, is that the particle effects definitely do kill the frame rate. Like, no matter how powerful your PC may be. It's just... The particle effects are insanity. I think you can all can, can, agree, can attest with. Uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. I think you all can attest uh, with me on that one. I don't know how to speak English anymore. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering well, how I ended up here. Ooh, another swarm. Okay, well, I left the Jadas over here, so I know where that is now. Oh, that's the one egg I was looking for. I was wondering where the other one was in here, because I was like, is there another one in here? Well, without a doubt. Oh, that is a uh, bulk detonator right here. You 
Yep, that is definitely the uh, horrifying sound of a bulky, of a very fat detonator. Oh no, I just summoned a double swarm. Crap. You know what, that's fine. I don't have the, uh, the uh, lead burster so I can just melt the, um, the detonator's health away, but I think the uh, plasma missiles will do the trick just fine. I just need to actually just be smart about this and not die like a dumbass. This is spooky. Hmm. I have an idea. Literally the best gunner player you've ever seen in your life. He's got movement, he's got tech, he's got strats, he's got zip lines, and he's got rockets. There is nothing that this world cannot handle. Or this gunner cannot handle. I already messed up the damn slogan. It's over for me. Dude, did you see that health loss on that Praetorian? Damn, dude. Goodness. Seriously, this overclock is not messing around. Rich atmosphere just makes this game a whole lot funner. Funner, is that a word? A lot more fun. Is funner a word? Probably not. I'm gonna assume that it, it's not a word and I'm just really dumb. Okay, can I get up back up here safely? Please don't touch me, please don't touch me, please don't- Oh no you bitch. Please stop firing at me. No, 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 no! Where's the resupply? Where's the resupply? Where's the resupply? It's over here, it's over here, it's over here. Okay, I'm gonna use two of these. And get another one. Many explosions in the background. And I did kill a Pfizer Flea with a cluster grenade, so that's some uh, insane skill dip on my behalf. I was shooting at a dead body, don't worry about that. I just wanted to make sure, you know. Why is there three acid spitters? And why is this overclock so freaking devastating? Why is this overclock so devastating, dude? It just does work. It'll slowly whittle down the bulk detonator, but... Like, oh my goodness, I love this thing. Well, that's one more for my belt. And the bulk detonator blew up the planet, and no one was able to, able to hear from the hollow bow ever again. And that's how the bulk detonator saved the hollow bow from Hoxies. Okay. Two more eggs this way. Um, I have two more that I need to secure over here, which I have not deposited just yet, so let's get to doing that. And we just complete that, too. Yeah, they're right down here. Um, there's also the Jadas down here, too. No, the other egg's up there. Okay. Right, 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 right. Alright. You're a good mule, Molly! A very good mule. Ow. Oh, there's already another mini swarm spawning? Oh my god. I'm gonna do that. Two that overclock is also pretty nice to use. If you're wondering the modifications that I'm running on it, uh, it's larger battery, overcharger, con concussive shockwave for the stun, which helps when uh, having them to be set on fire. And of course, uh, the shockwave. And then the necro thermal catalyst is what makes this overclock shine. Because <laughs> the explosions that you get from killing a burning enemy is uh, really good. For a second, I thought I heard an bulk, another bulk detonator, but that would just be an oppressor. 
Wait, where'd I put the other egg? It's over here. Not ready. There's me charging. All right, let's go ahead and get this uh, secured then. Against the oppressor's armor, not too impressive. Well, I mean, it does at least, like, damage, but it's not as impressive, though. It, it's all right. It's just an oppressor, though. Like, it's, it's, it's an oppressor. That's just the nature of him. Just being a bullet sponge. Oop, I'm going down. Going up. I'm also going to crack open a cold one. Don't tell management that I'm drinking beer down in Hoxie's. Truth be told, that I'm not, I'm not actually drinking beer, though. I'm drinking a Fresca. Alright, so there's two more eggs that way, two more eggs that way. I think I'm gonna go for... Do I see more nitro up there? I do. Thank you for revealing my, yourself to with your shiny shininess. I think I'm gonna go this way first. Pick the random chunk of Bismore that I didn't even know I uh, missed. I also hope that you like my pickaxe, too. I could tell that the bugs like my pickaxe. I was wanting to show off my pickaxe and then they just appeared. Boys and girls, please, ladies, gentlemen. There's plenty of my pickaxe to go around. That sounds very subjective, so I should probably stop right there. Goddamn thorns. All right. <laughs> Let us continue with this dirt path. Bam! Bam! I could have had Bosco dig through it, but I just chose the hard way. Because uh, life ain't easy. Well, it's one of these cave generations, huh? I bet you uh, there's going to be a cave leech in here. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? I just had the slightest feeling in my beard that there was going to be a cave leech because every time I see this type of generation in the cave, there's a cave leech that's bound to be in this type of freaking generation. I, I, I just had the biggest feeling. I'm like, there's probably a cave leech in here. Where did the other one go? Hello? Wait. Uh, what? Okay, hold on. I need to, I need to go back and uh, recollect my uh, thoughts. Hold on. Yeah, there's one in here that. Oh no, this is not good. Best moves, pro moves. I think I also saw the uh, best worst mug too, so I need to get that later. It's like right over there. I just, I need to remember to get it. So I got that egg. Where'd the other one go? Oh, it's over there. <sighs> I hate when the terrain scanner does that because of the fact that it's right there and the terrain scanner is blocking the damn egg. Oh, that's 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 really annoying. I couldn't see the other egg. I'm like, where'd it go? That was so weird. Anyways, we we know where it is, so we're gonna go back and get it. I have no idea what the hell you just said. Let me be very clear about that. <laughs> is there another swarm of bugs spawning? There is. Ow. I'm uh, I'm gonna go back down really quick. Fire the fire. Hot fire burn. Oh god, the frame rate. Yep, I I don't know why I turned the particles back on. <laughs> the frame rate. I think it's also because of the fact that the plasma burster missiles also kill your frame rate too. That's one thing that you have to be careful about. These uh, missiles will eat your frame rate like a like freaking Thanksgiving dinner. 
Okay, it's right there. All right, we got it. And we also got the best worst mug here. And here comes the whole. Oh, there it is. Got it. Oh, shit. Well, get it later. Get it later. Uh, for now, I need a resupply, though. Cluster grenades. Oh, yeah, the cluster grenade, grenade hit just right. I'll throw all my other ones. And then resupplied. I wonder if there's a mod that will let you change the color of the gunner's shield. Because I'd honestly want to see what it would look like if we had a blue shield, to be honest, or a yellow shield. Which is like a driller shield. Or, you know, obviously the engineer's red. I'd like to see what would happen if we had a yellow shield. That'd be nice. I don't know what it is about the color yellow, but Driller's making me fall in love with the color yellow right now. I don't know what it is. <laughs> yellow! Got it. Alright, six of eight eggs. Gee, I'm feeling poetic today. Yoink. All right, Mr. Oppressor. I will evidently deal with you when my frame rate has come back from the dead. I'm surprised that that actually did not hit me at all. That was very surprising. What the hell? Is there any more resources in this area, though, that we forgot about? Wait, hold on. Secure the best worst mug really quick, which is over here. The mug is over here. I honestly like the design of these mugs. The fact that there's there's a brat on like on the for the handle as well. Noise. Nice. I don't know if that's a new voice line or not. I remember playing I think the first Oktoberfest was on season two. God, it's been a while. It has been that long. But uh yeah, I, I remember that they didn't have enough time to put all the voice lines in, which is very which was very unfortunate, but now they put in new voice lines and I'm like, yeah, I'm happy. Bah. Ah! Oh, 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 fuck you. Asshole. I even heard that one too. That was uh terrifying. I've had the stupidest idea that in October that I should play three scary games just to see how it would go, and I'm starting to question my uh, my life decisions at that point if I'm actually going to do that. I do have an idea of what games I'm, I'm going to play if I actually do it, but uh, yeah. Don't get any funny ideas, though. I'm having the hardest time finding this damn dirt path. Is it over here? Am I stupid? Hold on. I'm gonna go up here. No? Well, I could just dig through this wall anyway. I don't know where the fuck it is. I feel retarded. Where was it? Or, oh my god, yeah, I'm retarded. Oops. Could have just freaking found a path myself, but I just decided to do it the hard way. Good job, Blue. I see that cave leech right there. I was about to say, there's probably another cave leech in here. There is. I'm getting good at this. It's just a slight shadow in the darkness that you'll see, and then you'll know that's a cave leech if you... 
How many spitballers are in this damn cave? Bruh. But yeah, there's like a sh slight shadow right there. That's a cave leech hole. So let me see if I can find another one. Which I cannot. Which is fine. Oh my god, my frames are being eaten alive. <laughs> they do not like this gun. It is a performance eater. Help me, mine this. Help me with that, Bosco. And I'll provide aerial support. The fact that you can also aim the rockets while you have your secondary weapon out is also pretty freaking awesome. Just like so. Never mind. Oh, never mind, they disappear. Hmm, interesting. Did they change that recently, or was that always a thing? I thought I was always able to do that. Interesting. No, yeah, they kind of go all over the place when you ha don't have your uh, the weapon out. I thought I could always do that. That's weird. What the hell has changed, man? Alright, we got one more Jadas to secure. Be a sweetie and grab that for me, Bosco. Be a sweetie. Noise. Oh, that's another block detonator, okay. The game is choosing violence today. Uh, can I push this before I evidently die? I can. Three goo bombers again, huh? Three goddamn goo bombers. Whoa, what the hell was that damage, dude? He had health for a second and then it just went completely. It's gone. I wonder if it's because of... That was some insane damage, dude. What the hell? I'm probably gonna die from that. Nope, I'm fine. I thought I heard another Mechera behind me and it was gonna knock me off my uh, damn zip line, but we're fine. Let's move, move, move. I secured the best worst mug, so we're good. I don't think there's any Jadas around here anymore. There's kind of an unexplored area there, though. Uh, nah, let's let's just go ahead and get out of here. I'm gonna grab one of these, though. I'm taking some of the ammo. I'll be fine. Yeah, what caused all that freaking health loss previously? I'm trying to replicate it again, but I can't. What? Okay, there it is. I think all the missiles are just converging in, like into one single pixel in the game or whatnot, and I think it's just causing massive freaking health loss. Probably. I don't know. That was satisfying as hell, though. And we're out of there. There is Plaza Burser missiles, and I definitely think you guys will like this overclock as much as I do, because it's so freaking fun! Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching today's video, and I will see you guys in the next one! Rock and... Wait for it. Wait for it. Stone. Rocket Stone.